And those 70 yards. <laughs> That's it. Devwa Whaley is a starting tailback tonight. And Kelly will throw on first down to a slant, and it fell out of the hands of Jordan Jones. Targets tonight. Kelly's going to take off in a design quarterback run, and he'll shove four. Heads up. It's the second time we've seen him come off his first read and deliver a strike. Kelly keeps this one. And he's going to lumber his way for an Arkansas first. Specifically called quarterback run to about 10. You know he's going to take a few extra hits. I want to limit those as much as possible. Into round on second and eight. Deion Stewart has to fight his way back to the line. In the backfield now for Arkansas. Kelly surveys the field, decides to take off. That quick. Well traveled tight end, came here from Yuma, Arizona. Kelly, incomplete, and we got a flag on the play. Derek Brown and I believe it was Marlon Davidson looping around, but Brown was the one that finished that off. You're right, though, Tommy. He's got a swagger and a calmness about his game. Under center this time. Pocket collapsing. And he dumps it off. Little screen to Chase Hayden. The freshman cuts it back. Hayden moves his way past midfield. Arkansas has yet to convert a third down tonight. Kelly hit as he throws and incomplete. O'Grady on fourth. Cole Kelly coming out of his own end zone. On an out route, fires in. Russell suffered five sacks in that game last Saturday. Coming out of the end zone. Third down four. Kelly throws it on the run. Caught but short of the marker. Jonathan Nance with the catch. See if Arkansas can get that run game going. On first down, they try it out. Rule that complete. Deion Stewart to convert a third down. Now it's third and 11. Auburn brings four. Kelly gets smoked by Holland, and it is incomplete. This is play action without establishing the run first. They're about equal in run pass play selection thus far. This one will open it up. The freshman Chase Hayden takes it into Auburn. David Williams now in the backfield. Kelly. Pumps and it gets dragged down. We've got a flag on the play. Best offensive lineman just moved to center half of last week. Just <laughs> it's, a, it's an effort play there. He knows. Yeah. You see it both ways. Kelly's a dude with a strong arm. Hadn't really had much of a chance. Here's Williams. He squirts free and Williams takes it to the, the tempo. On second and four, Williams dances his way to the 25. Trying to set up the run on first down. Devlin. Offensive lineman, probably who looked like his right foot and brought Gibson off the field. Back to the running game. And Whaley converted one of these. Now he's going to hand it off. Devon Whaley is able to pick up the first half. And Butch Jones in Tennessee still looking for their first conference win of the season. Loss of one that time. Wow. Thought maybe that was a Yeti 110 ice down. Pressure coming. Kelly steps up, trying to direct traffic, and a bullet over the middle. Did him 17 of 24 tonight. Second half against LSU, he was just two for 13. For six yards. Yes. And he was sacked twice. They get to Kelly, but he still gets it away. TD. And I thought Cole Kelly yeah. was going to get his head knocked off. <laughs> he almost did. What makes the time use the tight end at all, let alone with the screens? There's two yards. That's what I was worried about. Tested with a quarterback that can run. Elsewhere in the league today, tonight, Darius Geis. In the ball. You're gonna you're gonna be able to get Geis with some open lanes. How about your boy Drew Locke today? 467 and six times 400 yard passing game. Tied the school record that was set by Chase Daniel. I understand Chase is back at the game today with some of his teammates. Here's David Williams. He was buried at South Carolina. Whether he was in the doghouse for his play or just uh, relationship with Muschamp, I guess it could be debated. Bielema recruited him out of high school, so he was familiar with him. But even Brett Bielema said he's been a pleasant surprise. On 
third and seven. He gets taken down. Jeff Holland, he shot and killed Austin Revolt. Cole Kelly carries many reminders of that night with him today, including a bullet still lodged in his left leg. Auburn with the sack and a take. You're playing like it's 0 0. He's got about seven quarters under his belt. Competitive football, right? Second start. And Kelly try to move the last week against LSU in the second second half. Mm -hmm. Flag on the play. Controls its own destiny. Things are really interesting down there now. Yeah. It's a young team that's just learning how to play. Second and six for Cole Kelly. Pressure. Here's the screen. Devwall Whaley gets bottled up. Arkansas, she was a beauty queen from the state. Decided to transfer here to Fayetteville. They ended up retiring his number. I didn't get a silver medal. I got third place in that heat. That's about the best I ever did. Oh, Kelly was thinking about what would happen if they matched up with Georgia in the college football <laughs> playoff. That wouldn't have any drama. No. Blue coaching up that defensive line. That's a team that I think can be very dangerous down the stretch with a young quarterback if he continues to grow. Need to get their number one tailback help.